Good morning, good evening, good day. It's Tracy back from Matley House. How are you all doing? It's Timu Hall time. Whee! So I've decided I'm going to do try and stick to one per month on Timu. <laughs> yeah, we'll try. It might bust into two, but I'm going to try and do one a month. <laughs> so for January, I decided that I'm going to do aromatherapy because I went to one of my local stores a Dun Elm let me show you and I bought this jar and these sticks in there I bought two of these and two sets of the sticks and two aromatherapy oils one is linen one is eucalyptus yeah eucalyptus and I really like it. And it sort of, it's got me hooked a little. If you want to know about these, I got these from Dun Elms. The jar was three quid. The sticks were a pound. And the oil was two pounds something each bottle. But it's, if you know anything about me, you know I can get a little bit, I get hooked on things and then I have to buy lots of it. <laughs> so that's what started it. So then I decided to go and have a look on Timu and see what's there. So let me show you what I found. Now, I'm not into soap making or anything like that. I just like the jars with the water and the oils in sort of thing. So let me, let's get into it. So first off, let me start with these. I've got two packs of these. And they are the reeds, the sticks that you put in the jars. Now, they're a lot thinner than the ones that I got from Duns. If I show you the ones that I picked up locally, look how big they are. And these are... Now, I just assume you need more of these in your jar than you do if you've got the big sticks. That's what I'm thinking. I mean, I'm no expert on aromatherapy. I'm just starting to get into it. So it's pretty thin. And there are, how many in the pack? I think it's 50. 50 pieces in the pack. And I, I bought them in black. I like black. I like black and white. It's my favorite thing. So we'll try them out. I'm thinking they're going to be okay. I think I just need to put more of them in the pots. So two packs of those. Start them off. And then I got this pack. I saw this. These are reeds as well, but they've got like little flowers or a little a reed ball that you put on top as well. There's like a flower, two flowers. Now this is, this is foam. It's not made of reed or anything. That's definitely foam. That flower is foam. I think that is made out of reed. That's not foam. But it's the black and white thing. And I thought, oh, black sticks with the white flower head things. Let's try it. Now these are taller than that pack that I bought, but they're about the same sort of skinniness. They're still quite skinny. What are they skinnier? I don't know. And there is five in this pack. Now I'm assuming you just shove the head on. <laughs> Let's try it out. Ooh. The reeds are a little bit fragile. <laughs> that bent when I poked that in them. I'm assuming I'll just do that. <laughs> okay. It's not as good as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> but it's not bad <laughs> either. Especially for the amount of money that it was. And as normal, all the details, all the links are down below. Let me put them all on. They're all a bit 
then because they've been squashed in transit. Hmm, let me get this one on. Should we just balance it on the top? Ta -da. Ink. <laughs> I think when they're in the bottle, the oils, I might, depending on the height of the bottle, I might cut the reed down if need be. But I think that's okay. What do you think? <laughs> I'll definitely try them out. And as I'll... <laughs> That's what I normally do is if I find something's really bad, then I'll comment on it. So, so far, so good. That's okay for the money. It's okay. I like the black and white thing. That is really nice. And then there was a kit, and it is this one flower here that I really loved. It's sort of the white daisy with the black center. Let's get this open. I don't normally do a kit. I wanted to do it all separate, but I really wanted the flower. <laughs> How is everyone anyway? Hope you're doing well. Long time since the haul. I've been playing games. Because <laughs> I'm trying not to haul as much. <laughs> oh, lost me flower. And that's made of... Mm. Some sort of card. And we've got white sticks in this pack. We've got one, two, three, four sticks in this pack. And I assume you just... How'd you get the head on, though? Hmm. I don't know how you get the head on. I don't know. There's the little oil bottle. That's pretty small. So what is that, about two inches tall? And we've got a little, same as on the other cheap pack. And we've got an oil bottle. And what is the fragrance in this oil bottle? I'm sure it said it was lavender on the site. I'll have to put it up here. <laughs> When I find out, oh, let me sniff it. <laughs> That's a good idea. Okay. I don't know what that is. It's like laundry, like clothing, washed, freshly washed clothing kind of smell. It's, it's nice. I like that. Okay. Hmm. Now, I'm assuming the the ball's all right, because the ball's you just plonk on the stick. But they can go in that pot, look. And you'd put all of them in there. Fill it with scent. And then I've just got to get this. But I don't know how you get it onto the stick. That's, mm. I don't know, is the answer. How do you get it on the stick? Considering that is what I wanted in the first place. I suppose I could hot glue it to the stick. That's not the point. You can't just, oh no, there's, there's no ramming it on there. Hmm. That's not great, is it? It's not a good start, let's face it. <laughs> I don't know. It doesn't say, obviously, there's no instructions or anything. Um, no, it just says, read diffusers, offer a more natural way of dispersing sense, blah, 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 blah. But it doesn't actually say how to get the fl this flower on that stick. Um, the only way I could see that you could do it is by gluing it. But then the oil isn't going to seep up to the flower. Not loving this kit because of that. I mean, the smell was nice. 
and the box is nice but I'm, the bottle's a bit small but I, uh, the, it's the flower so I'm not loving that one not loving it so we'll put that up there <laughs> it's a lot easier just get a jar and make your own like I did over there <sighs> right let's put that up there have a quick tidy up no okay I bought some oils let me show you some of these let's start with this one and it is Jasmine, I think. I do believe it's Jasmine. And it's, there's three of them in the pack. Oh, need my scissors. Need my scissors. <laughs> what? It feels so good to do a little shopping haul again. I can do a shopping haul. Are we in yet? Yeah, we're in. Okay. <laughs> Jasmine. And this is a close up of the box. Okay. Aromatherapy oil. Where's my clues I've got? Here it is. <laughs> Multipurpose aromatherapy oil, 10 mils. Thank you. That's kind of what I wanted to know. Let's give it a sniff. Well, at least it hasn't got the kiddie thing on the top. That drives me mad, those kiddie things. Oh, it smells good. Have a sniff. <laughs> It smells good. Okay, I've got three of them. I like that. That is going to be a lush. Yay. Three of them. Three jasmine oils. Lovely. The next item. Same company that I got it from. Off of Timu. And these smellies are... What have we got here? We've got... Ocean. And what have we got? I think this is orange. Orange. <laughs> Bloody. It's so difficult to get some of these to focus. Focus. <laughs> And cherry blossom. Mmm. Have a sniff. Can't wait to smell the cherry blossom. That jasmine is lovely. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. Ta da! Ew, can't get in. Basically, doing it. Tracy special where she can't get in. Typical. <laughs> Jerry Blossom. <laughs> Let's have a sniffy. And they've all got a little. Oh, that's so good. They've all got the little dropper holes at the top, which is nice. Funnily enough, the one that I got locally from Dunn's didn't have a drop a hole. I had to kind of make my own. Oh, that is good. That smells really lush. That's the cherry. And we've got, I don't know what ocean smells like. Obviously, orange should smell like oranges, but does it? Let's take a quick sniff. <laughs> okay. 
You can see me getting carried away with these, can't you? I can. God. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Definitely orange. I like it. It's the orange bowl. Orange here. Nice. It's orange. It's quite nice. It'd be nice for the kitchen so that it's sort of... I like the foody sort of smells in the kitchen. <laughs> so I like things like vanilla and orange and lemon and things. This one is ocean. Now, I have no idea what this one's going to smell like because I don't go near the sea, even though I live on an island and the sea is literally 10 miles from me. That's close enough. <laughs> But this is ocean. Let's see what ocean smells like. Okay, it's mild. Yeah. It's really mild. And it smells of the smell of the outside. I suppose it is sort of watery. <laughs> I don't know. It does smell of outside, but I don't know what you'd classify that as, but that is supposed to be ocean. And I wouldn't order a pack of three of them, put it that way, like I did with the jasmine. I know what jasmine smells like, so I definitely wanted the pack of three of them. But ocean? Mm. Okay. Fine. <laughs> it's only 10 mil. I mean, I'm going to use that pretty quickly. This is the next lot. Same company. My camera's bobbing around again. Please stay still. Yeah, same company. So they're going to be the same smell. There is a pack of six, this one. And I won't open all of these because that's ocean again. I've already smelt that one, so we'll keep that one to one side. What else have we got? Oh, we've got an orange again in this pack. And we've got, is that cherry blossom? Yeah, we've got cherry blossom. Oh, that's what if cherry blossom didn't want to focus. <laughs> and then we've got these three. And we've got lavender, rose, and peppermint. Let's have a quick sniffy of these. Because I don't know what these smell like. What should we try first? Lavender? Now, I know lavender is supposed to soothe. Is it relax? I haven't got into all that yet, but I can see me getting into that, looking at what the smells stimulate you to do and stuff all i go by is i like that smell i'm gonna use it <laughs> pretty straightforward stuff <laughs> okay this is lavender let's have a sniffy of the lavender <sighs> yeah it does smell it's not really strong I mean, it's not really strong, actually. And it's lavender's not a great flavour, smell of mine anyway. But it, I'll, I'll use it. <laughs> I'll use it. But it's not stunning. What's this one? Rose. Now, rose should be nice, huh? I mean, who doesn't like a rose? <sighs> Especially a David Austin rose. Oh my goodness. Some of those are beautiful smells. So this is rose. Oh, turn it around, Trace. Camera's looking at my hand again. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> okay, rose. Shake. Oh yeah. This. Mmm, yeah, I like that one. They're not 
woo sense, you know, like really strong. But there again, Nivea was the one I bought locally. Let me compare the, this is linen. I mean, maybe it has got a slightly more <laughs> smell, but linen's quite a strong smell anyway. Rose, nice. And the last one is peppermint. I mean, my very favorite smell is eucalyptus. Love the smell of eucalyptus. <laughs> and anything that <laughs> empties out your nasal passage. <laughs> <laughs> make it woo nice and fresh I do love anything menthol and eucalyptus in and I saw peppermint I thought, oh gotta try peppermint okay. oh, there's peppermint's bottle oh and my camera's still at it Please stay still, camera. Ah, stay still. Okay. Yeah. Pepper me. Yummy. Polo mints. Mm. Yeah, love that one. That'd be a good kitchen one as well. <gasps> so there's my scents. Oh, I've got two more. These are from a different company and these have come in like individual little tubes which is very nice. So I'd probably, if the smell is nice on these, I'd head more towards these ones. So let's have a look. Static plastic. Oh, they're in a cute little, this little pot, how cute is this little pot? Right. Eucalyptus. It's me talking about eucalyptus. Get my face out of the way and it might. There we go. <laughs> Don't look at my nails. <laughs> I do like the little tubes that they come in. Now I know I'm going to love eucalyptus. It's nice. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> and it's still 10 mil again. It's nice that it comes in these tubes. Makes it more of a gift type thing. Like the gift type looking. And then I got one more in the tubes. Let's see if I can get it open. Ooh, what did I get? It's lemon. It's lemon. <laughs> oh, look at my bad nails. <laughs> okay. And the bottle. Essential oil. 100% pure. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Lid tight on that one. Woo. Very mild. Mm, very mild lemon. I mean, it's not an overpowering lemon at all. I'm interested to see what that's like when it hits the water, whether it goes too mellow or not. There's that one. So that's my oils. What have we got? We got quite a few out of that. Trace, of course you did. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen little pots of oil. Ignoring the one that came in the complete kit. And then I thought, I could need a little box or bag to put them in. <laughs> now, I, I prefer boxes to bags. So I went hunting for a little pine box that either I could paint or I could decorate in some way. So here's this. 
just a cheap little pine box. So look, the inner tray comes out, the inner grid comes out. So if you wanted to use the box for something else, you could. But obviously, I want to use them for my oils. So let's put all my oils in here. <laughs> Look, mad collection again. <laughs> and you could always, like I do with my inks and things, you could always um, colour dot the top so that you know what sort of scent it's going to be. And in the little tubes, they even fit. <laughs> Drop them all, Chase. Yeah. They even fit in their little boxes, so you could just keep all their boxes, which has got like the colours marks on top, which I might do actually. I might put them all back in their little boxes. And we got, oh, we got tick, sticky. Yeah. Let's take the sticky off. Ooh. <laughs> Unfortunately, they tucked it underneath the wood and then fixed it together. So you've got to go around the edge now and pick it out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See how it's stuck. So now I've got to, I've got to get a knife and get these bits in here. The top's not so bad, but it's the inside. You see how it's stuck here, all around the edge. So I'd have to go and pick all that edge. But once I do, there's the box with all the aromatherapy oils in. What do you think? I like it. And by the time I've coloured it and picked out the plastic, that's going to be nice. Nice. Right. One second. Okay, I have to go and get two more boxes. Right, I've got them. Let's get them open. The last two in my little smelly haul. <laughs> I'm keen to have a go and see what they actually smell like because they smell nice in the bottle. But see what they're like once they hit water, etc. So I was looking for a couple of pots. Here's one. It's black, it's round, it's ceramic. So you would let's do a for instance. These reeds are way too big. <laughs> Chase, they're way too big. That set, those reeds need cutting down to about here. Let me cut them. <laughs> La la. <laughs> la la. What do you think? <laughs> it needs more like skinny sticks. Because I think you might need quite a few skinny sticks for, to get the scent up. Not sure. Like I say, I'm no expert. Just having a go. Something like that quantity, maybe. I've got some short ones and some long ones. Now I might transfer me flowers to the tall ones. <laughs> but that's that pot. That's a cute little pot. And this came in, oh, it came in black, white, green, purple, purple. 
And who doesn't like a bit of purple? <laughs> I got black. And can you guess the other colour that I got? Let me show you. And I've got, I know he, I've got an aromatherapy cat. It's supposed to be like a little cat thing. And um, it like emits moisture in the air as well. So the diffuser does. What is, what is that called when it does moisture as well? Oh I've got a, a cat coming, but I'm going to put that on the next tool. I've got the next tool starting to grow over there. And once I've got enough, I'll video it. And that's the next pot. Now this pot, how long was this supposed to be? This was supposed to be purple. Does that look purple to you? It looks beige, which is a nice color. It looks good. I like the color. It is not purple. But I'm going to keep it because I like the beige. They look good together. Look. <laughs> nice. And that's okay. It's the next day. <laughs> I decided rather than end the video with the haul of all the aromatherapies, missing one or two items, I thought I'd wait. And luckily enough, they delivered the next two the following day. Which is why I'm. Um, a different t-shirt. <laughs> now this is the first item. And it is a little like, um, it's aromatherapy H2O humidifier. This is what it's classified as. Let's take it out. What have we got in here? We've got slightly longer than normal cable. The Timu, because normally they're this big, aren't they? <laughs> and this one is, oh, average size. <laughs> is that? I doubled up. Two feet. That's long for Timu. Little things in there. Funny enough, look, we have a cat sitting here too. <laughs> Monty decided he'd uh, join us today. Okay, so how do we work this, Trace? I'm assuming that's the water reservoir. Now this is gonna probably need charging. So let me charge it while we look at the next one. Isn't it? That would make sense, Trace. If you'd have charged it up ready. Put it yeah. Oh, oh my. Busy. All right, I've got it. Can't see it because the cable's not quite long enough. But I've got it plugged into the PC. And. Charge her up. Ooh, okay. Sit there, kitty cat, for a little while. <laughs> right, we'll come back to that in a minute. Because that is. Let me print. Because I looked. It's got. It says click the button and turn on to, for continuous spray mode. Press the button again to turn on intermittent spray mode. Third time, click the button, turn off all spray. And it just gives an ambient light. One long press button, which is like three seconds, to turn on ambient light mode two. <laughs> press and hold again for three seconds to turn the light off. Okay, so if you click it, it changes each of the spray settings. If you hold for three seconds, it changes the light settings and then eventually turns it off. So, you unscrew the top cover, 
then add clear tap water into the tank. Um, soak the cotton swab in the water before used or wait three or five minutes. Okay, so otherwise it's not going to wick upwards, is it, to spray it out? Okay, okay, okay. So that's where you would add your your drops of oil into the water tanks. We'll, we'll, we'll give that a few minutes and then we'll relook at it. See what happens. Now, the other item that I got, the last item that I received, that came all on their own and took forever, was these. And these are reeds. So I thought I could separate these in because they weren't cheap. They are falling apart a little. The cat is playing with my wires on the back of the door. <laughs> Let's get them out of the bag. Okay. Now that because they came on their own, I didn't think they were gonna survive at all. I thought, oh my god, by the time they get here, they're gonna be junk. And actually, <laughs> they're not junk. At least the stuff is already on the ends, unlike some of the others that I got, where you had to force it on the ends, and it is like raffia. So it should wick right up to the flowers. I think the only one that's got like, it looks like a plastic holder on is the carnation looking flower here. Well, that one is here. <laughs> There's a few of them. I mean, you could definitely split this into two or three packs, couldn't you? <laughs> well, they're not overly cheap. And I thought when they were going to get sent separately, because they came in just a, like a, a bag, like normal, but not tightly wrapped or nothing, just a loose bag that they sent through our post office. I thought, oh my God, they're going to be trashed by the time they get here. <laughs> I'm surprised. They're still alive. Look at them. And I, I quite like them. Do you like them, cat? <laughs> I like them. Now we've got... Yes. I don't know, I shouldn't really put them in with the black reed stone. No, it's not going to look like this. Oh, kitty cat. I've got a jar of put them in. Ah. I'm liking them. <laughs> I'm shocked. Totally shocked that they're actually alive. <laughs> this is just the pot that one of the oils come in. What do you think? I quite like them. Well, this flower is, um, that's not raffia, this one. This is material. Everything else seems to be raffia and reed. Just that one. But if you didn't like that, you could just get rid of it. Because it is a bit odd compared to all the others for some reason. Look. It don't really. This camera is not leaning the right way today. Push you about. <laughs> that's, that's a bit better. Okay. Yeah, I'm not loving this one flower because it's material and it's got that plastic underneath. But I really like the rest of them. And it actually, it looks better without that. I like them. I like them. They're, ex they're not cheap, but they're pretty good. I like them. So thumbs up for them. Right. <sighs> that's our lucky looks now there's no way this has charged up yet so what I'll do is 
I'll pause here and come back after it's had a little bit of a charge. Okay. <laughs> Let's have a nice cup of coffee. Mm. Hot coffee. Okay. I've half filled the reservoir and I've took the little spongy thing out of its tube and soaked it because it said to let it wick or soak and I can feel water all the way up to the top now so it should be good to stick it back in its little tube. So that's what I'm going to do. Now it's soaking wet. We should be able to stick it back up there. <laughs> Okay, so it's all stuck back in, and the wet sponge thing is in the tube. Okay, let's pick out some oils. Look at my little box. All my oils in. <laughs> I've still got two, four, six, eight, nine holes. What a shame. What should we put in here? I'm thinking cherry. What about cherry blossom? Oh, this box smells phenomenal. <laughs> We're going to put some cherry blossom in. Hmm. I have no idea how many drops. I'm just going to go berserk if the drops come out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, gee, mama. Maybe 20? <laughs> The bottle's two quid. I'm used to spending like nearly four quid for the plug-in things, which I love the plug-ins. But, hey, if I can get similar smells and only two quid a bottle. Now I've got my kit going. Oh, the cherry blossom. Oh, the cherry blossom is good. That's so good. I don't think I've put too much water in. It's said about halfway. I think that's it. Now, hmm. Now, how to work it? And what did we say? Click the button to turn on continuous spray mode, which I assume we don't want that. Press the button again to turn on intermittent. Anything? <laughs> no. Um, third time to turn off all ambient light. Press and hold for three seconds. One, two, three. There's no ambient light. Maybe it's just not charged yet. <sighs> okay, I'm going to have to put it back on charge. Oh, look, it's got, is that a red light? It's really hard to see at night. Or is that the ambient light? The press. Oh, there it is. Can you see it? I don't know if you can see that. Can you see that? Let me click over so I can see on the cam. Yeah, you can. That's for continuous, which might be a little bit much. <laughs> press it a second time. Trace, it's still continuous. <laughs> no, it isn't. No, that's... Intermittent. <gasps> okay, I can understand the dehumidifier about it because you know when you go to sleep and you wake up and you got uh, camel breath and like dry mouth. This is supposed to help with that because any humidifier is supposed to put a little bit of moisture in the air, so you shouldn't get that ugh, wake up like that. But I thought putting the oil in it as well and a nice scent. It comes out pretty regular. I mean, I don't know how, I mean, I've got it plugged into my PC at the moment, so I have no idea once it's full charged how long it's going to last. And what happens when it drains empty? Does it just carry on poofing nothing? And you saw how many drops I put in there. I can't really smell anything. It's cold though. The <laughs> the vapour that's coming out of it is, is chilly. 
There's no smell, so we need to go again. How do we turn it off? Just a third time. Do you think that's it? <laughs> okay. It works well. I think we're just going to OD on the old scent bottle and see what happens. <laughs> so, you saw how many I put in. Quite a few. <laughs> And we're going to go, it's quite a lot of water in there. So I'm thinking we need to go mad. <laughs> How about that, do you think? Can't need much more than that, can it? I can smell it in the water. So let's put it back together. Ooh. Wouldn't pick it up by the top. Wouldn't trust it. <laughs> Ooh, let's go again. Right, so push once for continuous, twice for intermittent. Cute little kitty. Look at the cute. It's better. I assume it's going to take time for the oil to wick up. That's what I should have done. You know when you get the sponge and you soak it, it should have been soaked in the oiled water. I soaked it in plain water. So I reckon over time, that'll come out smellier. Pretty rapid, isn't it? <laughs> I kind of like it. I'm going to have to let you know how I get on with it. But I'm going to try it, keep playing with it. I think I'm going to just get it charged up first. See how long it takes to charge up. And then run it without its being plugged into the PC. Okay. <laughs> That's my haul. That's my completed haul. <laughs> so really, we've got one item that I'm going to send back. So I've packaged that. That's going back because oh, I loved that flower as well. But I can look around for a flower like that separately. Unless you hot glue it to the sticks, I can't see it working. And apart from that, it's not just that. It's the bottle's really small. So I'm going to send that one back. I really thought these were going to go back. I really thought they were going to be a disaster. But actually, I really like the colours. I'll probably throw that one away. <laughs> But I really like the purples. So they're going to stay as well. And I really love the box. And I was looking on there for some feet. And they do like metal feet that you can put on. I'm going to get it some feet as well. <laughs> and I'm going to probably fill it up. That's it. That's the end of the smellies haul. Thank you so much for joining me. Please help a girl out and click the subscribe button. Until next time, be good. Bye.